velocity equals neg or 9t squared plus 6t. The position at t equals 1 is 20, so I would encourage you to write this out, x of 1 equals 20. So now we're going to integrate velocity again to get our position function with a plus c, 9t squared plus 6t. t is going to be equal to 3t cubed by the reverse power rule plus 3t squared plus c. Once again, I know that if I plug in x equals 1 for t, the result is going to give me 20. So I'm going to have 20 equal to 3 times 1 cubed plus 3 times 1 squared plus c. So 20 is equal to 3 times 1 is 3 plus 3 times 1 is 3 plus c. 20 is going to be equal to 6 plus c. So then c is going to be 14. So my position function then is 3t cubed plus 3t squared plus 14. That's my position function. And now it's telling me to plug in 3 to see what my position is at time 3. So x of 3 is going to be 3 times 3 cubed plus 3 times 3 squared plus 14. So 3 cubed is 27 times 3 is 81 plus 3 times 3 squared is going to be 27 plus 14. So what is this? This is 108 plus 14 is 122. Okay, and does it give us units? Yeah, so no units, so we'll just say it's at 122 units.